my procedure, the injury that was that caused me to have to have the procedure was um, I had plantar fasciitis that the tendon became tendinotic and the pain level was got pretty bad because it progressed up through the arch of my foot from the heel up through the arch of my foot which limited me from being able to run. I'm a marathon runner as well as I teach high impact plyometrical classes um, for athletes and do some sports and agility training so I was unable to do those at the level I was used to doing. Some of the procedures through the process of trying to heal this up, um, the first would have been a cortisone shot injection, um, which temporarily took care of the situation but returned rather quickly. Um, the next procedure was um, PRP, platelet-rich plasma injection, and it went pretty good after the procedure, but it was never really 100%. Um, the tissue didn't respond as well as we had hoped for. Um, so that was when I was in line to receive um, Tenex. On the day of the procedure, um, actually it, it went pretty seamless. Um, uh, it didn't take very long, just a, you know, maybe under a minute total um, from the time that they actually entered through the heel um, until they had finished. And um, as far as pain level or how that went through the procedure, um, I could feel something going on, but it was numb pretty well that I didn't know, you know, the excruciating pain part was not there by any means. It was probably very minimal, um, and we talked through the whole procedure, so I knew exactly what was happening and, and going on, so it was not, I was nervous, um, but it, it went fine. It went really well. Immediately after the procedure, as far as pain, uh, no, because I was, it was still pretty numb. Um, but once that wore off, there still really wasn't any, any pain like w which when I had PRP, there was a great level of pain because of the inflammation process was um, initiated. But with this, there really wasn't, it was pretty minimal. I mean, I never had to really take anything for the pain, not even Tylenol or um, Advil, anything. It, it was really pretty seamless. <laughs> Well, the procedure was done exactly today, three weeks ago. Um, as far as how things are going, I have progressed onto the elliptical. I'm still on non-impact, um, just due to where the incision is. It's still a little tender stepping down where they had to cut through the heel pad. But as far as the tendon issues I was having, I have nothing, no pain from that whatsoever. Most of it's just from healing, and really it's not even painful. I took about a week off. In a, and then um, I was allowed to start the following, it was probably about 11 days, I was allowed to start back on elliptical. Um, and I could progress on elliptical according to how, it, how I felt uh, doing that. Um, I started back with my classes. I'm still on verbal cue with those um, because that requires a lot of jumping. And we're just not quite ready for me to start jumping around on it yet. Um, but I foresee that happening pretty soon.